Next is a surfer, a former pro surfer who's now serving in the United States Coast Guard. So please give him props for that. Uh, you know, the, the Coasties are an important part of our life. If, if, if nothing else should, have, could, should, should bring attention to just how bad things are, just remember my story at the beginning about Steve Case, who now has a, an out-of-control bacterial infection in his leg from a tiny little cut that got immersed in what looked to be crystal clear, clean seawater. And of course, all of our surfers are in that all the time. And when you see the crystal clear water, you assume that it is okay to be in it. But uh, as we have learned, that is not the case. Water in the entire state is being polluted and it's being made too toxic for us to play in. So please, I would like you to, to help me welcome Mr. Jonathan Flick, Pro Surfer, United States Coast Guard. Testing, testing for clean water? Yeah. Test. Yeah. Thank you, Marty. Thank you, everyone. Um, yeah, I've been gone for about 12 years, and uh, I just love coming home. This place is so beautiful. And what's going on right now, this is awesome. That's horrible, but this right here is awesome. You know, my wife and I were driving down from the Outer Banks last night, and, uh, you know, we had the same issues up there, but the difference up there, no one's doing anything. Down here, you guys are actually doing something. This is so freaking cool. I cannot believe it. All these people coming out, all my friends that I'm seeing, they're all here. This is, this is unbelievable. You know, I'm going to go back up there and I'm going to be like, you guys got to stop complaining about our issues. You guys aren't doing anything. Look down there in South Florida. They're actually doing something about it. And they're making a change. And that's insane to me. Thank you guys. Don't thank me. Thank you guys. River kids. Look at these little munchkins. These little guys are awesome. Making a change. That's what we're talking about. Um, another thing, I was coming down and this is what kind of bummed me out. I was like, been stuck in the car for 12 hours. All I want to do is just get out and surf. But then I look over, I was like, can you even surf down there anymore? It's like, no, this is not happening. And then I find out all the deaths with the manatee and dolphins. Ah, and that just really, I'm really passionate about this kind of stuff. And it really fires me up. But what I'm getting more fired up about one more time is you guys and everyone doing something about it. This is great. Thank you guys. Yeah.